Hello, we are Christian and Corinne from CK Performance Clinics and welcome back to our Wingfold series. This episode we dive into the joys of toe side. A solid toe side is an essential part of your Wingfold journey. It allows you to make ground up wind, improves your jibes and opens the door to the world of tacking. A good toe side means being balanced, relaxed, whilst keeping your foil happy and the wing driving forward. Sounds simple enough. At first, however, changing your feet or coming out of a jibe into this new position can feel like you're balancing on a knife edge. It's a catch-22. To improve and practice, you need to be able to stay up on the foil. As such, our first chapter is a quick SOS, steps to keep you flying. And then we dive into the nitty gritty so that you can really up your toe side game. Ultimately, the aim of this video is to give you the tools to get comfortable riding toe side. As always, choose conditions suitable to practice and learn something new. And remember, always look around you. Let's start with a bit of vocab. The name tosal is slightly misleading. You're not trying to ride with all your weight on your toes, heels raised. You need to be standing on your feet and have the freedom to apply more pressure through the balls of your feet. Balance is everything. It's you, the board, the foil and your wing. You need to control the board trim from nose to tail and rail to rail. Having your feet nicely offset will make a massive difference. Use the wing for help. Move it forward and push your front arm away from you. This helps you stay over the board and keeps the board and foil trimmed. It also compensates for the tendency to drop more weight onto your back foot. Point the wing forward to give you forward drive and enough speed to stay up on the foil. Point it and then sheet in. Stand up and look. Stand over the board, legs slightly flexed, weight centered. Keep your head up to stop you bending and look forward to where you want to go. The more you bend at the waist or lean, the more support you need from the wing and the less balanced you will be. Once you get a bit more control, you can really work on your position. It's a bit more awkward to hold the wing forward while toe side. You don't have the same reach as you're used to. This is where the body twist comes in. Try this on land first to get used to the position. Open your chest to face forward and allow your shoulders to twist further. It will extend your reach and keep the wing forward. To give you even more reach, you can slide your front hand back on the handle. This can really help in lighter wind. Flex your ankles, stretch your Achilles and drive your knees over your feet to apply pressure onto the balls of your feet. Keep your weight centered. Your toe side position will feel less awkward if you narrow your stance. You can slide your back foot slightly up to keep weight on both feet and the board trimmed. Once you feel more comfortable, you can add power and drive upwind. You need a bit more oomph from the wing to ride upwind toe side. It gives you something to push against, which makes forcing the board upwind a little easier. Pull in with your back hand to catch more wind. Keep the wing low and pointed forward. Drive against the power to gently cant the board over, pushing your hips and knees upwind across the board. Your head and shoulders stay up, look where you want to go. It's about exaggerating everything, adding more torque to turn yet further upwind. Tense your body, locking every part so that it's solid. Twist your hips slightly upwind, away from the pull of the wing, and then flex them into the wind. This enables you to transfer more power through the board whilst driving it upwind. Most of us have a preferred leading foot. Whether you favour left foot forward, regular, or right foot forward, goofy, it's always best to start jibing and riding toe side with your strong foot forward. It will feel more balanced and more achievable. 
Here you go, time to get practicing. Work on your body twist, let the wing pull you and use it to drive the board upwind. And if you found this video helpful, please like it, share it and feel free to subscribe. See you next time. Cheerio.